Yeah, welcome to my YouTube channel once more again today. I'm happy to have you around. Thanks for being with us, for staying with us. If you're just um, joining us today, you're welcome. If you've been with us for long, I truly appreciate you. We're like family. So please do feel free to talk to me about anything. And I'll be very glad to be of help. Alright? Okay. Today we are going to be talking about how to protect your home or your shop using this. This is a broom. This is a broom. Okay? Broom is very good in protecting your home. Many people do not know this. But I'm here to tell you that you can actually ward off evil eyes from your home or your shop using broom. Okay? Alright. You see, this world we are in now is mysterious. There are so many things that happen, sorry, you know this, that happen on a daily basis. I talked about new okay. shop and new apartment. Then it's time for you to protect it using this. Something happened around where we are staying. There are about seven shops. So, all of us attacked. But they left only one shop, even though it's the first shop. They left only one shop. So, when we came out, we heard about what happened, how they, how, in fact, if you see the way they, they destroyed everything in those other six shops, you wonder what is actually, what happened. I made them to leave the first shop and invaded and vandalized six shops. So I went to the man and asked him, said, man, said, the man is not even my tribe. I met him and asked him, I said, how, what's the secret to this? And he shared with me. He told me he's going to share with me because I always patronize him, but he doesn't always tell people his secret. Many people were saying that maybe he, he, he was the one that called those people. He connived with them to do this, but that wasn't true. He used this to protect himself. He told me that every day, after he finished sweeping, he will keep this. He has a broom that he used to hang in front of his shop. I always see this that broom in front of his shop, and he always keeps the broom like this on the floor. He keeps it like this. He drops it at the corner of the shop to protect his shop from thieves, from burglars. <coughs> right? Sorry, ignore my baby diamond. <laughs> Okay, so I was like, wow, this is amazing. And ever since, I've learned. Because the, to be truthful, I never knew about this. Even though, during, when I was a kid, my grandmother, she always keeps broom. Whenever she finished uh, sweeping, she would keep it at the, at the corner of, in front of, his, of her corridor. And I, I never asked. I never asked. And she's late now. But since the man told me, and I said, wow. Is this, could it be? Could this be her reason? This is her reason. So I've come to share it with my family here, for you to know that you can actually protect yourself using broom. You can protect yourself. Just drop it in front of your house. In front, if you have a corridor, you can drop it there, or even in your room. Even in your room, it will protect you. Okay. And again, you can drop it even in your. Even you can you can hang it like the man always does. You can hang it. It will scare away witches from your apartment. To scare away witches and bring you good fortune. It will bring you success. It will bring you protection. All right. Okay. Let me. So you see, it's a very powerful protection against evil eye, against burglars, against thieves, against invaders. All you have to do is to know how to use it. Don't drop it like this. 
Don't bend it and drop it on the floor like this. No, it won't be effective. You have to do it. You have to stand it like this and place it close to the wall or at the edge in front of your house. Keep it like that and go to bed. All right? Leave it like that every day to protect, to protect your home. You won't notice any evil attack in your home. Okay? This is very effective and I would like you to give it a try. Give it a shot because I've tried it on several occasions and it has worked. Ever since I experienced it with that first man I told you, that my customer, you understand? Ever since I, I, I experienced it with him, I've never joked with this. I don't know how where you're staying and how people perceive it because you know most times people will see something and they'll be like, wow, this person is diabolic. This and that, the other one, you know? So it's not totally true. Uh, totally true. Okay? Sometimes it's not like that. We are doing all these things to be free from attacks. Uh, it's not diabolical because whatever that is diabolical has to do with uh, blood shed. We don't we are using our God given. After all, we use broom every day to sweep. Okay, we use broom every day to sweep. We sweep up house with it. Okay? We sweep up debt with it. So this will also protect you from every attack. From thieves. From 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 in, invading your shop or your house. Need I remind you that it's better prevention is better than cure. Because there are some and there are some robbers and robbers that come. It can result to rape. It can result to killing and other stuff. If you can scare them away using just a broom, then why not? Why not? It is God that created all these things. After all, we made this from, from what God created. Right? From the from. So, it's not a big deal. If you use this to scare off witches, to scare off pigs, it's a protective measure. All right okay thank you very much please don't bother um don't mind my my baby at the background <laughs> all right please just bear with me it's only going to get better okay all right thank you very much um i truly appreciate you and um i love you all as always okay i love you all as always diamond do you want to say hi to Hi everyone, you want to say hi? Say hi! Say hi! Hello! Give me a high five! Yeah! That's a girl, big girl! You know, she, she just turned one year. Yeah. <laughs> and she's so fast. Bye, I'm a smile! You're so beautiful! I love you. <laughs> okay, give me a kiss. Mm -hmm. That's how she kisses, you know. <laughs> All right. Bye, everyone. <laughs>